Oh, it's, we've had a good time so far. <laughs> How's it being back here at Warwick Hills? It brings back so many good memories. All the guys, you know, most of the guys we played here in the 90s and up to, what, 2008. We've always loved it. The course has always been great. They've got the best fans pretty much on our, on this tour. So um, it's going to be a great week. What are some of those memories? Well, VJ beat me two times. Uh, we both played great. Uh, just the golf course. We all like it. It's an old traditional golf course. It's kind of a risk reward hitting off the tee. If you, you hit your driver straight, you score over well on DJ said you brought that up to him the other day. What'd you say to him? Well, we, we he's on the range. He had, I think, a three-shot lead. I think I went eagle. I hit my nine or wedge in the second hole for eagle. Then I went birdie, birdie, birdie. And he he was we were even. You know, he was 400, and I was seven after five or something. He says, if you want it that bad, take it, kid. <laughs> but he got me. Fred Couple said he doesn't play a lot anymore, but he wouldn't have missed this. What brought you back here? I think just the golf course and the people and the old memories we've had. And, and you know, it's a golf course. If you play really good, you, you can make some birdies on it, get some confidence in the game. The greens are really good. The fairways are good. So, And we don't see – we get to see a little bit – golf courses like this being on the champions tour the old traditional golf courses i just love them and uh you know and i had some success here it even makes it even better how are your knees doing my knees okay i'm just fighting a sciatic nerve right now you had a pretty fun week i saw a lot of pictures on instagram people at the lions game saw you you've been hanging out with kid rock yeah some extracurricular activities making this week even more enjoyable yeah we had some fun it was we had a special night uh the other night kids uh rocks new restaurant made in detroit celebrated one year anniversary in the uh Little Caesars Arena, and we had a blast. And and my friends being able to hang out with him, he's so gracious. Let my buddies hang out. Up General Motors and guys are here, and uh, they're right on stage. Chris and my buddy, uh, uh, and we just—it was just a, just a it, it, him singing with Uncle Cracker and all the guys. It's just—it's so cool. It was just awesome. Did you get up Kid and sing? Be here this weekend. I actually, did get up and sing. Yeah. <laughs> Kid Rock be here this weekend to watch him? I don't know. I'm, I've got his tickets. He didn't know if he if he did, it'd probably be Saturday, but I don't think he's going to be able to make Can it. Can you hardly wait for the 17th hole? Huh? Can you hardly wait for the 17th hole? And it's going to get a, quite a reception for you. Oh, it's it's one of the greatest, you know, especially if, you, if you're playing good. It, it's, I love it. It gets really loud and noisy and crazy, and it's, it's a lot of fun. We know you've had fun with Kid here through the years, but how about Flint in the area? What do you remember? Where did you go? Any hangouts? Any special memories from the city at all? Well, I usually hang around with Kid Clarkson. We go to the Clarkson the Union restaurant. That thing is so good. We we went there four nights in a row the last time we were here, I think. Have you had the mac and cheese? Oh, yeah. And then the meatloaf is really good there, too. 